daughter Gabriella Chilmi grew up outside Melbourne in Australia. But she had to fly halfway around the world to land a record deal. At the age of 13, after being offered four major contracts in the US, she chose to sign with Island Records in the UK. Four years later, Gabriella's debut album, Lessons to be Learned, was released, and her debut single, Sweet About Me, started rising up the charts. In August, she proved she could hold her own with the Verve and the Kings of Leon, with her live set at the V Festival in Staffordshire. Yeah, I think it's really, really fun. It's really cool to play to a crowd that, you know, don't, you know, I guess some of them probably wouldn't be familiar with the rest of your tunes, and it's a way to kind of show them. So it's cool, and yeah, I get to check out the other acts, which is pretty sweet. Um, just hang around, lots of food, lots of music, two of my favourite things in one place. Very nice. In October, she was back in her home country after being nominated for a staggering six record industry awards. Yeah, I was pretty surprised at that. And it actually puts a bit more kind of pressure on me, so it probably would have been nicer if I got a few less, not really. But. She ended up converting all six nominations into awards, including Best Female Artist and Breakthrough Album, as well as highest selling single for the smash Sweet About Me. Two months later, she capped that high with a nomination for Best International Artist at the 2009 Brit Awards. She couldn't quite believe her luck as she walked the red carpet on the way into London's Roundhouse. Um, yeah, really, really awesome. Just like, I never expected a nomination, like, you know, for, for the Brits, but it's just like, just really, really cool. I'm like, really excited. I just got told this before, and the lady who like announced it to me was like, oh, you just, you've been nominated for Best International Female. Like, she didn't even like put it on an exciting voice, so it kind of just was like a shock kind of thing. It was like, oh. So I'm um, still kind of thinking of it, but it's really cool. At just 17 years of age, she was already learning to talk the talk about the outfit. So the look, so I'm doing a Beyonce because my mummy made my dress and uh, these shoes are Luella. I'm obsessed with Luella, she's awesome. And all my jewellery is by this lady named Fiorina and she's an Aussie designer. So um, you can never have too much bling.